नेक्स्ट वी आर हैविंग काइंड्स ऑफ फ्रिक्शन सो एक्चुअली वी आर हैविंग थ्री काइंड्स ऑफ फ्रिक्शन फर्स्ट वी आर हैविंग स्टैटिक फ्रिक्शन वन बाय वन आई विल एक्सप्लेन यू व्हाट इज स्टैटिक फ्रिक्शन नेक्स्ट वी आर हैविंग स्लाइडिंग फ्रिक्शन देन वी आर हैविंग रोलिंग फ्रिक्शन सो वन बाय वन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट ऑल थ्री काइंड ऑफ फ्रिक्शन स्टैटिक फ्रिक्शन स्लाइडिंग फ्रिक्शन एंड रोलिंग फ्रिक्शन सो हेयर वी आर हैविंग विद द फर्स्ट फ्रिक्शन so first we are having static friction so what do you mean by static friction static friction is the force of friction that comes into play when one object tends to move over the surface but there is no actual movement means this boy is applying too much force on this wall but wall is not moving anywhere on applying the force why because wall is having greater frictional force with the surface If an object is having greater frictional force with the surface then that object will never move anywhere as you can see wall is not moving anywhere on applying all the force this boy is applying his all force on this wall but still wall is not moving anywhere so this kind of friction where object is not moving anywhere in spite of force is being applied that frictional force is known as static friction next we are having sliding friction as you can see from the diagram also when one object slides over the surface of other object in that case sliding friction is there here we are having definition sliding is a frictional force exerted by a surface on an object when object is actually sliding over the surface of other object when this object is actually sliding over the surface of other object then here you can say sliding friction is there next we are having rolling friction as a name suggests rolling friction when one object is rolling over the surface of other object when this object is rolling over the surface of other object that friction is nothing but a rolling friction you can see when surface is like this only a part of ball is going to touch with the surface okay so here you can see interlocking will be less if interlocking will be less than in the rolling friction friction is less means object can move to a longer time period by applying even though less force but in the sliding friction in this sliding friction if you will apply the force on this like box here this box is having more physical contact with the surface when this box is having more physical contact with the surface then here irregularities between the surface and the box is also more if irregularities is more interlocking is more means here sliding friction is always more sliding friction is always more than rolling friction okay in the rolling friction only some part of object is in contact with the surface and due to some part of an object less interlocking is there so here it is easier to roll any object on the surface than to slide a like object sliding any object is difficult but if you want to roll something on object rolling is is easier as compared to sliding friction